everyone here and welcome to my channel graphic for you today i'm going to show you how to create a 3d element logo in after effects using element plugin it's very easy now let's get started okay first create a new composition then hit ok go to text and type your logo or your letters i'll type r s and now I want this point into the middle so I'll go here and press ctrl and double click and see yes okay now I'll go to align and I put my letters into the middle and I'll press S and I'll increase it okay now I'll go to layer auto trace make sure that you are on current frame then okay now I don't need this one so I'll delete this layer okay now I'll go to layer new solid and I'll call it element element then press ok go to effect video copilot and element okay now go to layers here Take some masks and choose auto trace. Now go to setup. Extrude. Okay. Make sure that you are on extrusion model. Okay. And go to bevel scale and increase it like I'll type 10 okay and go to bevel copies and 2 now we have bevel 1 bevel 2 so I'll go to bevel 1 texture and now I will open now I'll import my texture okay First one rock wall and this is the first one gloss and choose this one and also normal palm this one then press okay okay you can find this uh, materials on cinema 4d cinema 4d center it's free okay now i'll go to basic settings and i'll change this color Maybe like this and, and okay. now I'll go to bevel tool and go here okay and go to Z offset and change it to 1 C okay now go to enable and check Okay, now go to extrude and decrease it like this. Yeah, very good. Okay, now go here, presets and material, and I'll choose this material, this one, the gold one. On bevel. Okay, now I'll go here also basics or basics and I'll choose this or maybe this you can choose any basics here okay 
this one is going to fall and here we go. press ok see ok now I'll go to file and import my background smoke you can download it from google then I'll press S and I'll increase it like this and I'll go to effect and color curves and I'll make some settings here or some changes here and red also green and blue blue okay and also I'll go to effect again and blur and Gaussian blur make it 8 maybe 12 good okay and also I'll go to file and new solid and I'll call it optical flares and press ok go to effect video copilot and optical flares and I'll go to option here and I'll remove all these lights and I'll go here and I'll choose this one then press ok set on black to transparent and I'll put this on the top and I'll change this color to yellow Okay, now I'll go to file and and I'll import also FireSpark green screen like this and press S and I'll increase it like this and I'll go to effect key light and Also, you can download it from YouTube. Press T to opacity. Maybe 50 will be good. Yes. Very good. Okay, and now how to animate this law. So I'll go to element. Okay group one and group utilities and create group node like this okay now make sure that you are on the first frame then press s and i'll increase it like this a little bit and keyframe go to the last frame and decrease it Okay, again go to element and go to output and I'll check enhance multi sampling. Okay, yeah. Okay, now I'll go to um, render settings and 
ambient occlusion and also I'll check enable. Also shadow check and again I'll go to group one and particle locked and multi object and check and see. X and Y Z rotation. Okay, now I'll open everything here. I don't need this auto trace again. Okay, now I'll go to element and I'll increase or I'll decrease x rotation like this and also y rotation like this and t frame and zero And now you can try to uh, make any animation you want. So if you... Okay, this is our tutorial today. So if you like it, don't forget like, share and subscribe and goodbye.